Reacting to the picketing of the Labour Party headquarters in the Utako area of Federal Capital Territory by the members of the NLC, demanding the resignation of the party's chairman, Julius Abure, the Labour Party National Executive Committee, led by Julius Abure himself, has described it as an abuse of the law. In a press briefing in Asaba, the chairman of the party, Julius Abure, said that the Nigeria Labour Congress does not own the Labour Party. He said that the Congress is being used by some powerful persons to destabilize the party. Today, what we saw in the Labour Party was a show of rascality, an abuse of office, an abuse of the law of the land. The Nigeria Labour Congress is a subject of law. Nigeria Labour Congress, under the leadership of Joe Ajero, is not above the law. And the law, the law precludes Joe Ajero and the leadership of the NLC to do what they did today to the office of the Labour Party, where they besieged the office, broke the office, destroyed the fences of the office, destroyed the gate of the office, unlawfully took possession of the secretariat, and destroyed properties worth billions of naira, and properties of the party stolen away, including monies made for salaries, and several other things were stolen from the office. And I think that this is unfortunate, this is unrealistic, this is becoming unbecoming. Other speakers said that the party led by Julius Abure is not planning secret convention, which is one of the claims of NLC. Are you sure that APC is not the one using them to destabilize the Labour Party so that we can lose our strength, so that we can lose the comportment with which we face uh, the, the, the election or in the last uh, in the last dispensation, but we are assuring them that no matter what they do, it is they are they are, they are, they are not going to have their way. It's getting us, it's making us stronger and making us more determined that in 2027, Labour Party will take over power in Nigeria. Shameful, very shameful that the political commission of the Nigerian Labour Congress that was formed to go through all the political parties to get their policies that affects workers are now concentrating only on Labour Party. It's so shameful and disgraceful. I also join my voice to their voices to remind Nigerian Labour Congress, we are not cowards. We know the truth and we must stand by the truth. I challenge them once again to tell me how many of them can show membership card of the Labour Party. 